Hello there, Assalamu alaikum. This is your mental math coach, Muhammad Yasir. How are you? Hopefully you're fine. I've got with me a junior mental mathematician and I'm a bit envious. Uh, do you know why? Because my position can be replaced. Yeah, as a coach I want this. Someone comes and replaces my position. Well, I have with me, what's your name? My name is Saino Sarvaisha. Warisha, right? And, uh, well, which school are you from? I'm from Bigon Sino School and College. Are you very angry? <laughs> huh? No? No. Yeah, then give it a smile to the audience, right? That's good. Uh, are you hungry? No. Because hungry people are angry people. And I, okay, uh, took you to a radio program. Can you remember that? Yeah, you can, right? Okay, but there, uh, she did excellent job and I got huge praise from the audience and viewers. So today we want to show something about mental mathematics, how performance. Are you ready, mental mathematician? Yeah. Little math boss, you can say that. Little math boss, yeah? Uh, still are you angry? No. Uh, okay. Now, I'm going to ask her some big questions with small answers. But before I ask her, my question to you, how many of you know which one is the biggest number of the world? And I ask these questions to millions of students and thousands of teachers and almost all of them, they successfully failed to answer this. And I was once defeated to answer to this question and I was asked by my elder daughter. I didn't know. After that I learned it and I felt like teaching you and sharing our knowledge with you because we do care, our learners, our teachers. We do love our country. Yeah, so, what is your, uh, which one is the largest number of the world? Centillion. Centillion? How dare you say that? Who taught you this? Huh? Who taught you this? Hmm? You. Oh, I'm sorry, okay, then me, right. So, so that's the centillion. Yeah, she's right. I mean, centillion is the biggest number of the world. Not Googleplex, some people say. And some say million, billion, trillion. There's other numbers in between. Yeah. Now, can you explain what centillion is? Centillion is 303 zeros after one. Oh, that's a very small number. I'll take some minutes to write. Yeah. So, if you give power, Okay, then how do you express that centillion? 10 to the power 303. 10 to the power 303. My God, that's the biggest number of the world, right? Now, yeah. can you tell me some other big numbers? Yes. Yeah. If I tell you Googleplex, what is Googleplex? 100 zeros after one. 100 zeros after one. Where did you learn it? In Tissol. In Tissol, yeah. So you see, she is just a girl of class five. Now she's going to be promoted in class six and she's from a very renowned school, our most favorite school, Vikarno Samrudi School and College. And there are so many great teachers and great learners out there, you see. So, can you tell me how many zeros after one a Google Plex is? 100 zeros after one. 100 zeros after one. And do you know any other bigger numbers like trillion? Can you explain trillion in terms of power? 10 to the power 12. 10 to the power 12. What do you mean by 10 to the power 12? 12 zeros after 1. 12 zeros, she's right. 12 zeros after 1. That is trillion. Now, if I ask you a question, million. I want to be a millionaire though. No, I want to be a trillionaire. What do you want to be? In terms of money. Billionaire, trillionaire and millionaire. Which one? Hmm? Trillionaire. Yeah. Okay, I don't know whether it can be a centillionaire because it's really not possible uh, because in the whole world, no one is a trillionaire till today. Not Bill Gates even. He has got some billion dollars, some hundreds, uh, some 800, something like billion dollars, not yet trillion dollars. So we are expecting somebody will be a trillionaire someday. Yeah. Okay, now can you tell me about million? What is a million? Six zeros after one. Six zeros after one is mm 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 mm. Is that right? Am I right? Yeah. Yeah. That's good. Then. That's the million, right? 
I mean, one million. And we have got three zeros after one. What do we call it? Thousand. Thousand. Now, I know uh, she's a really genius student and she remembered my phone number. Just I mentioned my phone number once only and in the classroom and I took her to a radio station and successfully she remembered the phone number and gave the phone number to the whole country. Can you remember my phone number? What is that? 06-3368-6868 Sometimes I forget my name and she remembers her phone number. That's really crazy, isn't she? Yeah, okay. Now, uh, some tougher things we're going to do in our head. Is that okay? You will subtract some trillions and millions and billions in your head and no calculator will be given. Are you ready? Little math boss? Yeah. Yeah, let's see. Okay, if I tell you to subtract 100 trillion minus 10 billion. I mean, you will subtract 10 billion from 100 trillion. Five nines and then ten zeros. And uh, she took very little time. I'm really skeptical whether she really could do it or not. Let's check. Very doubtful. Uh, so 100 trillion, what do you mean by that lady? 100 trillion? Yeah. How many zeros after uh, in, in trillion? One trillion? Twelve zeros after one. And 100 trillion means? 14 zeros. After 14 one. zeros. So 10 to the power? 14. 14. And minus 100 billion. So in 1 billion, how many zeros? 9 zeros after 1. So if it is 10 billion then? 10 billion, 10 zeros after 1. So 10 to the power 10. So uh, let me ask another question like this way. 100 trillion meaning 10 to the power? 14. 10 to the power 14. And 10 billion means? 10 to the power 10. So if you want to subtract this sum like 100 trillion minus 10 billion. So what will be the result? 4 nines and then 10 zeros. Uh, I'm sorry to say, uh, she is not wrong. Ha ha! You did it, right? That's really good. She solved this problem and my father's father, my name, I mean grandfather, uh, he would not be able to do this. I really envy her, a great learner. I'm very pleased to get her. Uh, I'm her coach. So, dear viewers, you saw what uh, the TESOL learners learn at TESOL Bangladesh. You are most welcome. You can be one of us and I'll make you the fastest human calculator ever. So, join TESOL and we'll see you there in the classroom. This is Mohammad Yasir again from TESOL Bangladesh. Happy learning. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Yeah. How do you say Assalamu alaikum like that? Assalamu alaikum. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thanks for watching.